Tell me how long you've been out here training, and what is you know what is your routine uh, morning through evening? Oh uh, well, I just got back from uh, Utah, so I'm just getting here today to get back in the flow of things. And, um, but I was out here for two weeks uh, before the combine, two straight weeks. Start off the day by getting some treatment from Tito at like 8:45, and then start stretching at 9:30, and then uh, get on the court by 10:30 with Don. So we go to about 12. And then you get 30 minutes of rest and get some uh, protein shakes or whatever, and then right to the weight room with uh, Ryan at uh, Proactive. So every day, same thing. Um, has there been anything that's been uh, surprising or just different uh, between your what you've been accustomed to during your time in college and uh, versus how you're preparing to be a professional? Um, I think it's kind of interesting how the same thing applies for it the league too. You just got to be in great shape. I think that's the biggest thing uh, we we do here. We try to get in the best shape we can for the workouts where when guys at the end of the workout are so tired, we're still pushing through. So I think that's what we do here the best. Uh, everybody who comes here knows how to play basketball. We know how to play. And then going against great players every day when we go live, it's, it's, it's a treat. I mean, it just helps you get better, helps make each other better and uh, to get ready for workouts and uh, see what you can do in the league. So what goes into being in the best shape possible beyond what maybe the casual fan would, would think about lifting weights and running around? Definitely. Uh, we run um, down and backs, uh, and we just do stuff. We do stuff when we're tired. Uh, we'll run like five down and backs and then go shoot. And then we'll do five down and backs again and then do lane dunks and where you have to dunk it. And that just gets your wind up and your endurance. And it, it helps your uh, mental capacity of just pushing through tough times. Um, give us a, a scouting report uh, real quick in terms of uh, what are your strengths, uh, what are your areas of improvement, and what has been your focus uh, as you've been out here the two weeks prior and now coming back in? Um, strength has definitely been versatile. Uh, being able to make plays at my size and uh, how long I am and how I can disrupt teams defensively, uh, getting my hands on balls and being active defensively. And, Making plays, I think that's the biggest thing. Making plays on the offense end for other people, make it easier for them. And uh, definitely been working on my shooting, been shooting the ball a whole lot better, and uh, continue, I'm going to continue to do that. And at the next level, uh, starting off as three and D guy won't be that. Will be is what teams want, and I think that'll help me out a lot. Well, what do you bring to the table in terms of off court? What what are what are what are your, some of your your strengths uh, as a, as a teammate? Uh, I'm just a guy that people enjoy being around because I'm always going to have fun. Uh, I look at life as far as something that you just got to embrace and cherish. Uh, there's a lot of people that would love to do what we do and um, we get the we get the choice to come out here and play basketball for a living and that's what we love to do. And I think I, I come out here and try to have as much fun as I can and uh, take every opportunity and have fun with it. Uh, what's your uh, workout schedule looking like after the pro day? <laughs> Oh man, I got nine more workouts left, uh, a couple back-to-backs, but I'd rather have workouts than not have any. How do you prepare? Do you have a do you have a game plan for handling all of that uh, all of that travel and all that hustle bustle? Uh, my thing is rest. My biggest thing is rest. I know I can go out there and play at the highest level, but when I'm rested and ready to go, that's when I play my best. And uh, I think LeBron LeBron talks about it all the time. He sleep is the biggest thing. And when you're on the flight, see if you can get some sleep in, get as much sleep as you can. I mean, changing time zones is going to be tough, but at the same time, you, it's a NBA life. I mean, you got to get ready for it now. Uh, last question. Uh, what are you hoping to accomplish at tomorrow's pro day? What, if there was one thing that you want uh, the audience to take away from, from what you've done and make an impression, what would that be? Uh, just the fact that I can knock down shots. Uh, we don't go live where I can show I can play defense on anybody, but at the same time, you just do what you what you control. So we'll be shooting a whole lot of shots tomorrow and just knock down the open. Thanks a lot, man. Thank you. Appreciate it.